Welcome to the channel. Serenity OS started almost as a joke, a completely custom-built operating system featuring a 90s-inspired interface and an obsessive attention to detail. Its main developer, Andreas Kling, initially started the project just for fun, with no particular ambitions. But over time, Serenity OS became much more than that. Unlike traditional Linux distributions, Serenity is not based on any existing system. It's not a fork of BSD or Linux, but a fully standalone OS with its own kernel, window manager, file system, and even custom graphical libraries. However, it's not designed to be installed on real hardware. Instead, it runs exclusively in virtual machines. Serenity OS is more of a demonstration project, a software engineering experiment, rather than a system meant for daily use. But the most interesting part of this story is that from this seemingly amateur project, something truly promising has emerged, Ladybird. Ladybird is an open source browser that aims to become a real alternative to Chrome and Firefox. Written entirely in C++ with no heavy external dependencies, Ladybird is designed to be fast, lightweight, and fully open source. Unlike most browsers, which rely on WebKit or Chromium, Ladybird is developing its own rendering engine. This is a rare feat in today's world, where almost every browser is based on just a handful of dominant engines. The project is still in its early stages, but the goal is clear, to create a modern browser, free from telemetry and truly independent. Ladybird's official release is expected in the coming years, and it could represent a major shift in the open source software world. Serenity OS proves that even a passion project can evolve into something big and Ladybird might just be the proof that the browser monopoly isn't set in stone. If you want to follow the development of Serenity OS and Ladybird, the source code is available on GitHub and the community is growing every day. Will this truly be the open source browser of the future? We'll find out soon. Thanks for watching.